Salut à tous, c'est Fredox, bienvenue sur ce deuxième épisode de la deuxième saison de The Walking Dead. De retour avec Clémentine, ainsi que notre nouvel ami Sam, un chien qu'on a découvert dans l'épisode précédent. Donc on avait découvert une sorte de campement, plus ou moins abandonné, afin de voir si on pouvait trouver de la nourriture. Donc on va fouiller un peu tout ça. Ouais, ça a pas l'air très engageant. Oh my god, thank you. Look, Sam, I can. Now I just need something to open it with. On a trouvé une boîte de haricots. Donc entre temps, euh, la traduction a été patchée vu qu'il y avait quelques problèmes avec euh, les accents. Ça a apparemment été résolu. Ce qui est plutôt pas mal. Merci au traducteur encore une fois. Eh, c'est... Est-ce que c'était le chien Ou un autre chien sur la photo Je sais pas. Un frisbee pour s'amuser avec Sam. Voyons s'il veut. Hey, wanna play? Wanna play catch? Ok, bring it back. Good boy, Sam. <rire> Attente dans un triste état. Celle-là aussi. Think anyone's been sleeping in here? I can't tell. Maybe we better not wait around to find out. Il nous faudrait donc euh, un outil. Ah. Ça m'a découvert quelque chose. Sam. Ok. Look, you can see the bite. Looks like he tried to cut it out. It's okay. We're smart. He's not. We're smarter than all of them. Peut-être on peut risquer d'attraper le couteau comme ça. Je sais pas. Ouais, bonne question. On va essayer de faire tomber le couteau ou de le frapper, je sais pas. Stand back, ok Ouais. C'est vrai bien que <rire> tu le mordes pas. Ah, 
Deuxième essai. Sans résistant, hein. Un couteau pour ouvrir la boîte de conserve. I bet we could open the can with that though. Still pretty sharp. Okay. Well, now we're getting somewhere. Please don't be bad. Ce <coughs> serait pas de chance. Il doit avoir fait lui aussi. I guess you are pretty hungry too. <rire> Mettons. Here you go. Hey, you don't need it all. Oh, okay. <rire> putain. <rire> Ok. <rire> C'est apparemment pas une bonne idée. Il est pas très reconnaissant encore. Désolé mon vieux, mais bon. Sacrée blessure, ouais. Ils ont décidé d'y aller fort, ouais, sur cette saison. Pauvre Clémentine, <rire> il faut tout subir. Ouais, cette blessure, euh, j'imagine qu'il va falloir s'en occuper. Avant que ça s'infecte.
Oh, un rôdeur. Même plusieurs. qui sont pas très rapides. Courez, euh... <rire> ouais. Oh, si. Un groupe de survivants, voyons voir <rire> s'ils sont un peu mieux que ceux qu'on a rencontrés jusqu'à présent. I think, I think we're safe. Yeah, yeah, we're good. Hey, you all right? I, I think so. What are you doing out here? Where are the, uh, the people you're with? There's no chance you made it this long on your own. I don't want them thinking we're doing anything but trying to help you. My friend and I got attacked. Hmm. These folks mentioned what they were after? They might have just wanted food. We were cooking some sort of weasel. They attacked you for a weasel? Damn. That is low. They didn't mention any names, right? They weren't searching for anybody? Hmm. Well, I'm Luke, and this is Pete. Hey there. Hi. I'm Clementine. It's nice to meet you, Clementine. But for now, we're going to take you back to our group. Okay, we got a doctor with us, and you look like you could use some... Oh, shit! Ah! What? What is it? She's... She's been bit, man. Fuck. Fuck, fuck, fuck. What are we going to do here? Hmm. No, it was a dog. I didn't see any dog, Clementine. Come on, kid. We just saw you with those lurkers back there. I can't remember the last time I saw a dog. So what do we do now? No, no, just look at it, please. <laughs> yeah, and have you sink your teeth into Pete's neck? No way. My neck? Why am I the one? Because I don't know a dog bite from a mosquito bite from a lurker bite, man. It's not. Let's see it. Whoa, 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 hey, watch yourself. Hey, don't look at me like that. You're the one that's bit here, okay? See? Is it, uh, is it like she says? Hmm. Well, it could be a dog. Hard to say. So where'd this dog go? Yeah, what, did this? <laughs> what, what does that matter, Pete? Seriously, I want to know how believable her story is. I... I killed it. What? Really? A dog shows up and bites you and you just kill it? What would you have done? I don't know. It attacked me. Still, you don't... you don't kill dogs. Clementine? Yes? You telling us the truth? Évidemment. Look me in the eyes when you answer. Yes. Hmm. All right, Clementine. That's good enough for me. Well, what else was she gonna say? I've got a good bullshit detector, Luke. That's why you can never beat me at poker. <laughs> you don't always beat me at. All right, how can you be sure? Well, I'm sure I ain't willing to leave a little girl in the woods to die when we got a doctor with us that can make a call. We can have Carlos take a look at it first. Nick ain't gonna like this. 
Not with what happened. You don't have to remind me of that, boy. Right. Sorry, sir. Come on. Clementine, are you feeling all right? I'm fine. Just tired. Well, you better be fine, because I ain't carrying you anymore with that bite on your arm. Don't worry about... Oh, shit! <laughs> Bon, moi ils ont mis de sein avec eux, c'est plutôt pas mal. She already told us that she and her friend were attacked. Then she was bitten by a dog. What? And you just believed her? You should have put her out of her misery right there. Dog bite my ass. I need a dog. <coughs> Keep your finger off the trigger, boy. Whoa! Whoa! What the you fuck? You idiot! Every lurker for five miles probably heard You're the that. one telling me to fucking shoot her. Everybody just calm down for a second. Clementine, you okay? I just need a doctor. And then... and then I'll go. I don't want my arm to get infected. None of us want to get infected. That's the point. We got a doctor right here. Okay, he'll have a look. Now what the hell is wrong with you people? Okay, she's just scared. We're all scared, Luke. Don't act like we're the ones being irrational because we don't buy this bullshit story. No way she survived out here on her own. Why are we even arguing about this? Let me take a look. L'ambiance a l'air bonne aussi dans ce groupe. It's okay. Go ahead, he's a doctor. Must have hurt. Hmm. Whatever it was, it got you good. This isn't how we do things, man. When you're bit, you get put down. End of story. I'm not going through this again. No one's suggesting that. We could take her arm off. <gasps> Super. Uh, Bonne solution. It won't do any good. You'll just be making it worse for the girl. It's crazy. No one's going to volunteer to do that. Au docteur, il doit savoir si c'est un chien quand même. Then what? How would we know it worked? Just let Carlos have a look. You're a doctor, right? Aren't you supposed to help people that are hurt? I promise you, it was just a dog bite. That's all it was. We'll know soon enough, young lady. Who's she? Sarah. What I say, stay inside. I don't mean to be any trouble. I just want to stop the bleeding and then I'll go. You'll never see me again, I promise. And where exactly would you go? Find my friend Krista. Forget it. You won't get five feet. I understand you're scared. And I feel terrible delaying treatment. But we've got to be sure. <sighs> so, what do you think? Was it a lurker? A bite like that could be anything. Only one way to find out. How? We wait. What? By tomorrow morning, if the fever set in, we'll know if she's gonna turn. In the meantime, we can lock her in the shed. What about my arm? It needs to get cleaned and, and stitched and bandaged. The girl is in bad shape, Carlos. And we have all that stuff inside the cabin. We could probably get by Alvin, with it. Alvin, please. But, yeah, we can't do nothing. I'm not wasting supplies on a lurker bite. If it turns out you're telling the truth, I'll clean it and stitch it up for you in the morning. But... I'm sorry. It's the best we're gonna get. Finger off the trigger, son. I ain't your son. Don't be like that, man. It's all right. Boy's got his mom's temper. Come on. 
This is just a waste of time. You'll see. And when she turns, I ain't gonna be the one cleaning up the ship. My arm really hurts. I don't know what to tell you except hold out the best you can. We'll see what we can do in the morning. If I make it until then, maybe you could get me some supplies? I wish I could. I really do, but it's too risky. Sorry. this way and I'd rather be sure. Yeah, okay. <rire> Décidément, l'aventure continue pour Clémentine si on peut dire. Bien, on va s'arrêter là pour cet épisode. Je sais pas s'il faut essayer de sortir ou juste explorer pour attendre le lendemain. On verra ça dans le prochain. J'espère que ça vous a plu et je vous dis à la prochaine fois pour la suite. Allez, salut